figuring you're probably going to be a starter this year? Uh, that's what I'm been. That's what I've been working for. Uh, nothing's set yet. Kind of still battling through the fall, trying to earn a spot. But that's what I've been working for for sure. How did you prepare yourself through the off season for the increased workload? Uh, this summer I was supposed to try and build up my innings, but I ended up just getting stuck in a closer role this summer. But this fall I've been increasing my innings and throwing more pitches in each outing. So it's been it's been a good it's been a good progress. Put a lot of good work in. It's been strange for you in college. I mean, you come in and you're a closer the next year, you're a shortstop, and now you're the starter. It just sort of adapt year to year, you feel like? Yeah, I mean, it's been fun. I've been doing something new every year. It's been keeping things fresh, but I've been pretty good at adapting to it. Started what you wanted. I mean, that's been the goal, though, I assume, all along to, to get yeah. to that point. Yeah, for sure. Everybody wants to be in the weekend rotation, so to get a, sh get a chance and get to work for that, it's, it's definitely a blessing, for sure. Coach mentioned that not many wholesale changes in terms of what they took out of the exit interviews with the departing seniors, but also just kind of looking at some small things, ticks here and there to kind of change up the off season from past seasons. Did you see anything um, in terms of different workouts, different maybe aspects or wrinkles at practice from, from last off season to this one? Um, we kind of changed up how we went about practicing this year. We, we were with the coaches more at the start of the year, I think, and then we came back and it's been more player practices and stuff, but they've done a really good job of like coordinating all of it and getting us all our, like we've done a lot more work than we did last year and the previous year, I think, so. Did just, you guys paid off a little better? Yeah, I mean, we've all, the team's gelling more than they have. We're getting to know each other better and just getting our work in. It's been, it's been a good fall and winter so far. A lot of high praise for this freshman class so far. What's kind of been the thing that stuck out to you from the guys that have just come in? Uh, they kind of just stepped in and got after it more than years past. No, not a lot of nerves, not a lot of – it doesn't seem like they feel the pressure, and they're just all really good ball players. So, so a lot more expectations on you. I mean, you've got first-round rankings out there, prospect things from a guy who, you know, people are expecting maybe what they haven't seen yet from you. But mm -hmm. does that add anything this year, Nolan, that – you know, people are going to know who you are, even though you haven't been out there and been a starter. Uh, I mean, it's I can't really control anything. I can only control how I go out there and go about my business. So expectations are kind of it's expectations I've always had of myself anyway. So their expectations don't really bother me that much. Is there any kind of added juice to the year knowing the defending national champions are a few miles up more? Ha, huh, man. I mean, we're always. We're always definitely trying to beat them for sure, and it hasn't happened since I've been here yet, but I think we got the team to do it this year for sure. Got an increased workload going into your starter role. Are you feeling good and healthy? And yeah, all that? body feels great. Been Workouts have been really good. I mean, uh, it's definitely a different throwing schedule than I've had before, throwing every day as a shortstop and then going into the pen and stuff, but it's, it's been really nice to just kind of focus in on the arm and the body and stuff. And not have to worry about hitting and taking ground balls and stuff.